This is the new ruffler for sewing the panels off the 1344. Features of it are that there's no folder, there's no stripper blade. The cloth blade is the stripper blade. There's a set of guides for the flanging to control the flanging position. There's an edge guide for the border to control the border position left to right. The entire plate swings out, give you access to the machine, threading and maintenance. Locks with a torque handle. There's a flange roll holder underneath the cloth plate with the sensor for detecting flange run out. There's a wipe switch for turning the ruffler on and off when you get to the corners. The control box has been moved over out of the way to allow clearance under the table for the panel to circulate. The control box, very similar to the other rufflers, with the exception of the two middle switches, which used to be corner count, no longer have a usage because we're not detecting the corner. And the switch that used to be auto manual has been changed to an off switch for the sensor on the flange roll holder. If you're not flanging, you can turn that sensor off and it won't give you a false error. You turn it on when you're flanging off when you're not flanging. The foot pedal is uh, movable for operator comfort. On the flanging sensor, if the flanging sensor is turned on and there is no flanging, the machine will not sew. The machine is dead. That's your indication. So if you're sewing along and all of a sudden the machine quits, it's because you've run out of flanging. If you're not going to run flangy, you turn that off, and now you can now you can run the machine. The locking feature for the ruffler for swinging out is tied into the foot lift. So when you want to swing the ruffler out, you do a foot lift, and the ruffler swings out. And you do a foot lift again, you swing it back in. All right, load the flanging under the foot in the guides. Load the panel to the edge guide, and so find the corner with your finger, so to the middle of this edge guide. Turn on the ruffle. So to the next corner. Find the corner with your finger. Middle of the edge guide, turn on the ruffle. When you get to the end, the heel back, cut the thread, cut the flanging. Load the next panel. Find the corner. Go to the middle of the edge guide, turn on the ruffle, find the corner, middle of the edge guide, turn on the ruffle, Here's the ruffles in the corners. Flanging inside.